Welcome back to Georgia Cooking for the Soul. Today you all are making cheesy grits and I'm frying some catfish and I have just two small grams here. Okay, on the stove with the uh, grits, I have two cups of grits in the pot with two cups of water. Right here I'm washing, washing the fish. And I have some oil heating up on the stove where I'm going to fry the fish. Okay, and I'm going to show you what all I uh, seasoning I put on my fish. It's very much, it's, it's just almost really the same, the same season I use for chicken too. But we're going to be seasoning this in just a minute. It's not a whole lot. You have to do the catfish, just rinse them real good because, you know, they already done skint, they got the skin off them. They already skint. Okay, my cornmeal, all I use, I use half of, half seafood bread. And the other half is just regular self rising meal. Okay, right here. It's the same. My little mixture, the adobo seasoning, the large season salt. And accent. That's what that's what I'm putting on this fish. And then I'm gonna put some black pepper at the end. Okay, let's shake a little black pepper on all of it. This is optional. You don't have to put pepper on yours if you don't want it. But I like pepper on my fish. Now I just mix it up. Put my grease get hot. I will be seasoning and showing it to y'all. So I'll be back. Here's some of the catfish frying and the grits. Frying. Got some red on take up. The other piece took a little bit longer. Okay, okay the grits. I'm gonna add some butter. Okay, I'm gonna add cheese. Add as much cheese as you want to make it cheesy. Down some. Stir. 
Okay, I also like to put a little black pepper and then a little black, black pepper. Just a little bit. And all I do now is just let this finish cooking, let the cheese melt in it. Thicken up, okay, right to the catfish. Just how much black pepper you want, if you want any at all. But everybody don't want black pepper in their kids. Okay. Here's the catfish. Two catfish. With a glass of lemonade. I want to thank y'all for watching my channel. I want you to please subscribe, share, and like. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye.